Hi everyone, my name is Eric Sun, globally certified brand ambassador at Porsche Center downtown Toronto. Today we're actually answering a very important question. A lot of people that are afraid of the uh, electric car technology and are worried about how charging is done and how feasible or how quick it is to charge your electric car. So today we're here to answer that question. We're currently at the Electrify Canada charging station here today to showcase how easy it is and how quick it is to charge up your Porsche Taycan at one of these stations. When you are taking delivery of your Porsche Taycan vehicle, your Porsche Pro delivery specialist or your salesperson should have set up the two apps we have on the screen here. One is the Porsche Connect app, the other is the Charging North America app. Uh, as you can see, uh, the let's open up this uh, Porsche Connect app here. Uh, you can see that our Porsche Taycan 4S is showing in the app. And um, the app will show you a different sort of information. As we can see from the top of the screen there, we have the climate control screen. Um, and when you enter this climate control screen, uh, the vehicle will allow you to um, set the temperature that you want to. Now, go back to the main screen. You do have the ability to check out your e-mobility status, which is your current charge level. On the left side of the screen, you see that we have 27% battery life. On the right side of the screen, showing 92 kilometers of range remaining in the car. This is our starting status uh, before today's charging test. Further down, you can set up timer uh, to have the vehicle automatically start charging at a certain time period. Let's say if you're parked at home and plugged into your garage charger. La later down the app, we have our trip um, info, trip data, a total mileage on the car, and even the tire pressure uh, that's showing on the vehicle as well. Uh, at the end of the app, we have the alarm and modes settings where you can actually um, put uh, put the vehicle in valet mode, set speed limits or location alarms for your vehicle. Okay, so that's a quick overview of the Porsche Connect app. Now let's head into the Charging North America app. That's this green icon here. Now, when you get into this, it will show you all the Electrify Canada and Electrify US uh, stations. And for today's purpose, we're, we're picking the one that's closest to downtown Toronto, uh, the one at Agent Court. Uh, is this green highlighted one um, up here in Scarborough. Okay, so we can zoom in and you can click on the green icon to bring up the information. So you see here it says Electrify Canada showing the uh, address of the charging locations. And you see three out of the four stations are available. Uh, currently, the 350 kilowatt fast charging is unavailable at the moment, but we do have three level 250 kilowatt chargers readily available. By clicking into the 150 kilowatt, you'll see that one, two, and three is currently showing as available to use. Before proceeding further on the mobile app, first come to the side of the car, open the charge port by swiping the finger underneath like so, and open the secondary charge port to enable the DC plug, okay? Now come up to the charging station, take out the charging plug, and plug it into the side as such until it clicks. Now we can proceed on the mobile app to actually activate the charging session. Now back onto our mobile apps, you wanna open up the Charging North America app, the green icon one more time. Once you have the app opened up, then let's select the 150 kilowatt uh, charging station. So our car is currently parked in front of the number three station. So let's click into the 150 kilowatt um, selection. Now select uh, station three. And once you select that, this screen will pop up. Uh, it will tell you um, to plug in the vehicle and then you can just simply press uh, start charging. So it will be unlocking that uh, charging station. Uh, then the screen will go away. Um, outside the vehicle 
will um, be plugged in and then uh, the charging will commence. Uh, the station will make a very distinct uh, noise when the charging actually starts. Now that our charging session is completed, to unplug the vehicle, press this pulsing icon on this button here. Now it's fully illuminated white, you can unplug safely, press on this button and wiggle it out. Now we can return this back to the charging station. Now that the 30 minute session is done, the charging station will show you a summary page on its main screen. We actually took the car from 27% charge to 57% charge within this uh, 30 minute time frame using the 150 kilowatt level two charger. Now let's head back into the vehicle. Before you do that, make sure to close the flap here and close your charge port. We started the car with 27% uh, charge uh, with 92 kilometers of range. And then after our 30 minute session with the 150 kilowatt level two charger, we went to 57%, we gained 30% and to a mileage of 200 kilometers. So 108 kilometers in total. On the next video, we're actually going to look at charging the Tycon vehicle with the 350 kilowatt fast charger at one of the Electrify Canada stations and give you guys an idea of how fast that is. And I welcome you to Porsche Center Downtown Toronto. Check out our inventory of Tycon electric vehicles and take them for a spin.